Hey guys, just uh, wanted to update you on uh, several tweaks that they have made after the newly released update. So if you haven't updated your Vivo V9, you can just do that by going to the settings and here you will find system update. Just tap on this system update and here you can see that Funtouch OS there will be a download button. You just have to download and automatically it will install. So once you have installed that, what they have done in the camera settings is they have removed the four square mode here. So they have removed the four square mode from here as you can see previously there were uh, uh, six icons over here but that is not the case right now. So what they have uh, done is they have moved it to the videos if you just swipe up and go to the videos because uh, there were slow motion, time lapse, document and uh, such thing in that square mode they have moved that to video here. I think this makes a lot of sense because it is a video mode obviously slow motion video is what you are capturing so inside the video as you can see there is icon of camcorder here you just tap on it and here you will find the slow mo time lapse and normal so if you want to capture slow motion obviously tap on that and just uh, make sure you have properly focused and start recording the slow motion video so this is what they have done slightly they have tweaked and the next what you can do is if you want to again bring back to normal just again tap on this and you will see the normal here from here you can change the 4k 1080 and 720p resolution obviously and what they have done is if you go to the take photo and in the settings over here as you can see previously there was full square square and normal those were the three modes basically it will change the aspect ratio of uh, the picture so now what they have done is they have introduced 4 is to 3 aspect ratio 19 is to 9 to cover the full screen and 16 is to 9 see this 16 is to 9 aspect ratio is really important because that is what we see directly on television or uh, today's lcd monitors led monitors and such so what they have done is they have introduced a 16 is to 9 aspect ratio so you don't have to crop and do such things while viewing on tv so 16 is to 9 for that and 1 is to 1 is there for uh, social media sharing you can quickly share uh, and you don't have to crop at all and there is this 4 is to 3 aspect ratio so what they have done is they have introduced four different modes here so you can switch to change the aspect ratio and other than that they have not really much changed anything so if i find anything new i will definitely update you guys and um, also one thing to note the document mode previously which was again in square mode they have moved here if you just keep swiping at the bottom you can see now there is a doc separate document mode is there so that you can scan the document very nicely from this mode so these are the settings that they have changed and one thing i mentioned in my previous video which they have not yet updated hopefully if, if vivo sees this video so if you just go to the settings you have this model watermark and time watermark but unfortunately you cannot add your own watermark or say edit the model watermark so suppose i capture the picture right now and what you get is this vivo v9 dual rear camera watermark okay so you cannot edit it suppose if you want to add your own text just i will straight away go to the inbuilt editor then go to the text here and if i just tap on this you will have the copyright symbol here so i want to add my copyright symbol but you just cannot do that because it says emoticons are not supported this is not the case in oppo f7 you can easily add emoticons while editing the picture so i hope if vivo sees this they will fix this issue as well because i want to add my own watermark so that I get my name here whenever I capture my picture. So that's how it is. Uh, hopefully they will release and fix the update. So these were the things they have changed. Hopefully it has helped you. And if yes, please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned. I'll making a lot of interesting videos on this channel. So see you all in the another one. Till then take care everyone. Bye bye.